It's an important thing for New Zealand coming up in uh, 50 days' time. The Junior Rugby World Championship has been played here in, uh, in New Zealand, in Auckland, and um, it's a significant uh, thing for, for, for New Zealand, but I think for, for rugby in general, we've got uh, over half the current All Black team played in the Junior World Championship, so it's a pretty good pathway to make the uh, national side. I think from a New Zealand point of view, uh, England uh, won it last time, so uh, you know, New Zealand team will be pretty keen to get our hands back on that trophy. So we're looking forward to hosting that in, uh, as I say, 50 days time. I'm sure that your future All Blacks, who play in the Junior World Championship in June, will be showing the same flair and determination. I wish you all the very best with hosting the tournament, and we'll both be watching very closely. Have a good afternoon, thank you. Well, I think it's a good chance to see the stars of the future, you know. Usually the at tournaments played in other parts of the world, so to, to see you know half of uh, the All Black team uh, played in that team uh, as they came through, so yeah, it'd be a good chance. And uh, I just remember it was a sort of previous version of it, but in 2000 played in Auckland uh, when we uh, won that tournament. It was a pretty special time, so um, yeah, it was, it'd be pretty cool. It's definitely exciting to watch, and I mean, you know, these 20 year olds are grown men. Um, when you're going in the battle and they're just, you know, just at the start of their career, so it's uh, you know, a great sight to see.